Hi. Hey. Uh, please introduce yourself. My name is Simone. I'm the business development director at Stellar Telecommunications. So what do you see here? It's a bunch of antennas? So yeah, it's a bunch of antennas. Basically, this is internet wherever you are uh, by simply plugging it into the power. So this is a box that you plug it in the power and it connects you always to the strongest signal. It aggregates all of the signals from every network that you have around. It's bonding SIM Up to cards. four cellular operators. It's bonding uh, satellite co uh, communications networks and it's bonding Wi-Fi networks. Satellite? Yes. So it switches to the best network, combines multiple networks, predicts... And predicts the next best network. We, ha we know the availability of the network and the quality of the signal on roads. And so as the consumer and as a, per as a customer is driving around, we're not reactive on the, system, on the signal drop. We're basically proactively switching you onto the network that is going to be the best in 100 meters from now when you're driving. Can you, uh, can you open the antennas? Of course, of have course. A look? So there's uh, four times two. Each, each SIM card gets two antennas. So you have two SIM cards, uh, physical SIM cards, two uh, eSIMs in there, uh, two Wi-Fi connectivity solutions, and then you have the Ethernet ports for for plugging in the various external uh, internet Starlink. access solutions that you will be having. Starlink comes right in here. We do the management and the aggregation uh, with that. Starlink under foliage doesn't work, under a roof doesn't work. We would be compensating Starlink going down with perhaps two cellular operators coming up. We have the agreements with all of the operators. So basically the way this would work is that you're not buying this box. You're going on our website and you tell us when you need this and where you need it. We would ship it to you. By shipping it to you, we're basically right now covering Europe, Switzerland, and the UK. Uh, we, we ship it to you, you plug it into the power, you use it. Once you're done, you put it back in the same box we sent it, and it comes back to us for free. And uh, it says here, uh, supported by the EU. Yes. And uh, Nouvelle-Aquitaine. Nouvelle-Aquitaine, yes. So it's, a f um... so it's French based. We're based in, uh, in Bordeaux with the support of Nouvelle-Aquitaine and the European, uh, European Union. And, uh, and of course, we're operating across uh, Europe. We have offices in Luxembourg, in Germany, in Italy, and in France as well. Do you use AWS or some other cloud? We to use kind of bond? Three, We use three cloud providers. So the whole point is not to rely on a single one at any given time. We always pick the best for each, each given country, depending on where our customers are driving. Mostly, is the whole point is mobility. We know that internet on the road is rather weak when uh, when driving around. And so with this, through the switching and their combination with the various network operators, we're capable of giving you a flat, a constantly ubiquitous, uh, let's say, uh, broadband connectivity for, for usages. Uh, it could be something that's, uh, I guess, some uh, Flix bus companies. Correct. Or these kind of companies, they would want this on every bus. Correct. Originally, we, we, are, we are thinking about this for consumers, and that's what we're here presenting. For us is uh, uh, camping tourism, frequent travelers in cars, uh, event organizers that don't trust how the internet is going to be at the venue, uh, or holiday home owners. But then we got reached out by a lot of fleet operators that actually want it for bus, for trains, for trams. And, uh, and so we have the, the fleet version of this, which is a bit more of a rugged... Uh... Sorry, the battery ran out. No so you're saying some fleets? Yeah, fleets are reaching out to us because they basically want this for trucks, buses, trains, trams as well. And it's something that actually we originally wanted to do pure consumers, but the intention of uh, the interest of fleets is kind of strong. But that's not uh, that's not consumers, it's uh, big companies, In right? that case, it would be real B2B, of course. They would so need we're to buy a uh, thousand pieces and put on all the buses. A bit more than that. So right now, global is for consumers, and then we have a global fleet, which is the version directly for operators and for fleet operators. Uh, because uh, I like live streaming at some kind of event sure. like this, but I gave up because on this one, I try a few, I try in Europe and stuff, because I, I need to bond yeah, two yeah, operators of course, of course. to try to keep yeah, the, sometimes even one megabit yeah, working. The uplink, the uplink for a content creator is amazing, so that's the reason actually why we are focusing. We have agreements with almost 200 operators. So our objective is to give you up to 500 megabit per second in down and 300 megabit per second up. So we're talking about something that our premise is very simple. You put this next to any other internet access solution, at speed test, it crashes it. You said 300 up? 300 megabit up, yeah. You will give 300 megabit? We're already giving it. It can be ordered right now. Anywhere in Europe? It can be ordered right now, anywhere in Europe, Switzerland, and UK. 
anywhere and people can anywhere. bond to 300 megabit up because Correct. sometimes i always wonder yeah, how it works creative, when smart. i buy a sim card i don't know if i'm getting priority bandwidth yeah and I often think they, they, they throttle it down quite yeah. a lot they give you like a couple of gigabyte a day and then it goes down the conversation is completely different here the conversation is really to give you i mean i'll tell you our our model in terms of pricing we are one here at ces and for the first months of launch we are 154 euros for 175 gigabytes and this is down and up, at up to 500 down and up to 300 up. It's, it's, it's a serious thing. We are the company that did the mapping for connectivity at Tour de France. And uh, we've seen that on those roads for almost 40% of the time, there is zero signal. With this, we bring that 40%. You had it on the Tour de France? We, Tour de France, we did it for mapping of the connectivity. And so uh, the typical usage of a mobile phone would be with 40% down time, which is unbearable. With this, you would go to a downtime of 4%. Wow. Over 3,464 kilometers of Tour de France. That's, uh, that's really cool. Um, and the bonding software that you develop, yes. or that you use, is yeah. compatible with any cloud provider? Well, it uses so you our... Just install it where you want, on Google, or Amazon, or whatever? Ish, because basically, I mean, it's, it's our proprietary software. So we handle the cloud part. All of our computing, it's, it's AI-based, basically, the logic on which we do the selection of the networks. So all of our... Uh, decisions are taken in our cloud and then we give to the box the the capability of basically act upon the decisions of the ai without making processing that is local this allows us to have a box that is really slim really light and uh, and uh, and incredibly incredibly fast to use basically and what's you can the, see the ports do you talk about cpu or secret uh, well, no, we don't, we don't disclose those information, but it's because basically the whole point is to give something that is plug and play pure for the users. They don't need to have any understanding where don't it comes from. Don't need to know from. if it's uh, Qualcomm or whatever. I'll tell you how it works with consumers. Yeah. You order it, it gets shipped to you. Whether you want to plug it in a car or at home, it doesn't matter. You take it, plug it in here, plug it in the power. We don't even need to open the antennas. You're on in 60 seconds, you're online. There's a Wi-Fi? But then uh, Wi-Fi is always, it's like a micro oven. There's like a micro oven booth over there. It's a micro oven spectrum. So you want to connect Ethernet to be sure. If you want. And then you it's use here. the Ethernet and you, you get go. a really good 300 megabit upload. Yeah. We, we can actually, it's, it's via Wi-Fi that we can get you 500 and 300. Uh, it's, uh, it's, uh, with Ethernet, you will get a bit better in that case. Wow, that's cool. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's, very, it's a very powerful device. Uh, <laughs> uh, so is it new? Yeah, it's unveiled today. So today is the moment when the website to purchase it is live. Uh, and we're targeting at the beginning, European Union plus Switzerland plus the UK. Global.com? Getglobal.com, but you can go directly on internetonthemove.com and it goes directly here to purchase it. Internet nice. on the move, internetforcar.com, it goes always there. Uh is your company on your background in the telecom stuff? Yes. Uh, most of us are aerospace engineers or telecom engineers. And then we have a big part of the company, of the, of the team, that are automotive uh, uh, experts that come from the automakers and car manufacturers. We can, that's their interest on mobility for this, is basically. Because it's really awesome what's happening with the Starlink stuff. Amazing. But you cannot rely completely on it. You need to combine it with the 5G, Correct. 4G. Correct. And it, then you have a perfect world, right? Correct. And, and there is another thing. With a solution like Starlink, which is absolutely phenomenal, but with a solution like Starlink, what is happening is that you're ordering a device. First, you're paying an upfront fee, of course, for the device, but then you actually need to install it. You need to drill holes into, let's say, your camper van. You're drilling holes on the roof to stick something on top. The, the concept of this is literally like, plug it in the power, throw it in the camper, use it, or at home, or whatever yeah. you want. Once you're done, unplug it, send it back for free, done. But maybe you have a package that includes the Starlink dish that, that you have. also rent together and have to send it back together. That we don't have yet. You just need to call Starlink and idea. say if we can have it from yeah, Europe and Switzerland a in that case. and London yeah. and UK. Yeah, that would be absolutely a good idea. We're not, we're not going that far in terms of uh, reselling partnerships with external providers because the concept is really we want to go on simplicity. And currently other operators, unfortunately, including Starlink, even though they are amazing, they don't get the level of simplicity that we want to achieve to get the user experience. So in your uh, YouTube streamer camper van, you, you can install a Starlink and you on have your van this, and, and you then have it add managed this, by this. Add this. Yes. You would put it in here and Global will handle your Starlink plus four cellular connectivity, two most of the time, two cellular uh, networks plus Wi-Fi that you encounter. If we don't know the, the password of a Wi-Fi network, you would just let us know the password of that. 
by connecting to the to the capabilities of the box, the IP of the box, and the box would basically start orchestrating Wi-Fi, cellular, cellular, Starlink if you want. All right, uh, 144 euro for 175 gigabytes. 54 euros for 175 gigabytes. For what month? Or for, for, for a month. For months. So all right. Yeah, but it's not subscription. So yeah. if you want to, you can use it up to a month. Basically, what we say is that within a month, ship it back, put it back in yeah. the mailbox. It's free. We pay and for shipping. And if you need more. Data, you just buy more? You just buy more. All right. If you need it for longer, you just extend it. Cool. All right. Thanks a lot. Pleasure meeting you.